So just to finish up uh, all of our options that we ha currently have in this particular prop, uh, let's go and finish up the decor option here. And that this will be, you know, really simple. I'm going to keep this one really simple. Uh, you can go and add multiple options in there. And then just like we did with the door, you just put in a slider for how many options you have and then hook up a switch node. Uh, and that will allow you to give the user the ability to switch to different decors um, that you want, different decorative elements or whatever. These are basically just kind of caps on the cabinet. Uh, you will see it every so often on a cabinet when, you know, it's just kind of a decorative element that's not a door or drawer or anything like that. It's just something that is there. So um, this is just going to be a string of poly extrudes, basically. And so uh, to do this, I am going to drop down a poly extrude node and we're just going to inset it a little bit. So maybe I just put in a little border around here. Make sure we just turn on extrude front and then we could just keep copying this um, to create some sort of really quick design, right? And so if I put this now on extrude front, it'll extrude in. So let's actually move the this down a little bit and maybe punch this in a little bit like so. Then copy it, right? And then let's negate or get rid of the negative sign. And that'll put that right back at the same surface. Cool. And then let's do another one. Yep. And this time let's remove any distance, keep it flat and let's go in a lot more, something like that. And then, uh, let's copy it again, but this time we'll do a really tiny inset. Yeah. Something like that. And then we'll go in a little bit and then again, just copy it and get rid of the minus sign. Yeah. You know, <laughs> nothing fancy. Uh, you can go crazy with that stuff. Uh, I have to actually go and find a couple other designs that I want before I put in some more options. So that's why I'm just going to leave it here. I think you guys, by this point, hopefully um, you guys have the idea of, you know, how to go and add more options to this. So I'm going to make the depth here just a little bit smaller. Yeah. This thing is coming along. Turn it into quite a full featured prop here. All right, so just a quick video there, just showing how to do the uh, the decor stuff. Pretty cool. Yeah, we're coming right, right along. This thing's pretty complete so far. Uh, the other feature I wanted to add was to put a sink in here. I noticed uh, in the reference, uh, these guys just have a little sink area where you can wash dishes. No, like, faucet or anything like that, but I think that would be a cool feature to add later later on down the road all right so i'm gonna leave you guys there in this video let's uh, move on to getting some vertex colors on this and then doing our unreal test